All right, solving this problem. So I'm just going to take the reciprocal, so 1 plus sine of x over 1 plus sine of x. So what I get is 1 over sine of x times 1 plus sine of x. And then this becomes 1 minus sine squared x. So I get, um, well, I get cosecant x and I'll just leave it in simple form plus one all over and this simplifies down to cosine squared x um, so sine you know what actually I'm gonna leave this in So I get one plus sine of x over sine of x over one minus sine squared of x. So furthermore, um, this is going to become one plus sine of x over sine of x, one plus sine of x, which cancels out. I get 1 minus sine of x. So we get 1 over sine of x minus sine squared of x. You can probably, you know, Gosh dang it. I'm sorry. Um, uh, just make this. Um, yeah, you're going to get mad at me. Just make this one. So we get 1 over sine of x plus 1. And you just make this uh, cosecant of x. And technically this, this satisfies the no fraction rule. So there you go.